Once upon a time, in a magical kingdom, in a village that was like a fairy tale, there lived a cute boy named Ali. Ali's greatest passion was to visit the antique shop and explore old items. One day, he found a dusty old carpet in the corner of the shop. The carpet was very eye-catching with its patterns, and Ali was intrigued by it. Ali immediately cleaned the carpet and laid it on the floor to see the patterns more clearly. After a while, he noticed that the patterns on the carpet were moving. The patterns danced and changed shape on the carpet, as if they were alive. Ali was enchanted by this sight and realized that the carpet was magical. Ali sat on the carpet and said the magic word. The carpet began to rise and slowly started to ascend. As Ali looked around excitedly, the carpet rose towards the sky and began to move quickly. The carpet took Ali on a wonderful adventure. First, they flew over a large forest. The forest was full of giant trees, colorful flowers, and cheerful animals. Ali was mesmerized by this natural beauty and continued to explore on the carpet. Then the carpet began to fly along a river. There were fish swimming in the river, water fairies dancing on the surface, and children playing by the riverbank. Ali was fascinated by the beauty of the river and found peace among its calm waters. The carpet took Ali to the top of a mountain. At the top of the mountain, there was a magnificent view. As Ali looked around, he saw birds flying in the sky and flowers blooming on the mountain slopes. He thought it was one of the most beautiful sights he had ever seen. Finally, the carpet took Ali to a castle. The castle was the heart of a magical kingdom. As Ali explored the castle, he encountered magical creatures and mysterious rooms. Each room had a new adventure and discovery, and Ali was thrilled to explore this magical world. After spending time in the castle, Ali decided to discover the magical power of the carpet. He carefully examined the patterns on the carpet and said the magic word again. This time, the carpet took him beyond time. Ali participated in adventures in the past and future, exploring different cultures and times. Once, the carpet took him to a deserted island where a dragon lived. The dragon had fled from another kingdom, and the islanders were afraid of him. However, Ali managed to talk to the dragon and listen to his story. The dragon wanted to live in peace with humans, but he couldn't achieve it because of their fears. Ali decided to stay with the dragon and talk to the islanders, eventually bringing peace. Later, the carpet took Ali to a magical forest. The forest had a wish tree that granted everyone's greatest wish. However, to maintain the power of the wish tree, one person had to sacrifice their greatest wish every year. When Ali learned about this, he decided to sacrifice his own wish, thus preserving the power of the forest and the wish tree. Finally, the carpet took Ali back home. He had become a very different child. The wisdom and courage he gained from his adventures motivated him to help people around him. Now, he wanted to teach everyone that there was an adventure in everyone's life and that everyone Although Ali's adventure seemed to have ended, it was the harbinger of new beginnings for him. Because now his eyes were opened like the eyes of a child who could see the unseen, hear the unheard, and turn dreams into reality. 